Hey everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. In today's video, I'm going to be cash stuffing paycheck number two for June. So if you're interested in seeing this, please be sure to stay tuned. Okie dokie. So I have my money ready. Let's count it up and see what we've got. 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96, 7, 8, 9, 400, 5, 10, 4, 95, 96, 7, 8, 9, 400, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So I'm pretty sure that's $406. <laughs> All right, so I have switched wallets for a while. I decided I'm going to use this one. This is a Moterm. I believe I've used it at some point in the past, but um, yeah, definitely bringing this back for a little while. I like the little bit of a slimmer design because it fits in more bags and I tend to carry smaller bags in the summertime just because it's hot. So I know I have some change. Get that out of here and I do have a re few receipts to put in my receipts apps the information for all of my receipts apps are in my description box and then I have my cash envelopes all right so let's put this to the side in beauty um, in beauty I'm going to do 48 five six seven eight for nails and then 78 for hair 50 75 six seven eight i don't know what happened but somehow my hair and nails has like my meat appointments has gotten all jacked up so <laughs> that's okay like the order has reversed somehow so that is for beauty for food, we are going to do 60, 20, 40, 60. So that is awesome. Miscellaneous had a rollover of 20, so I'm going to take that out and put it in one of my sinking funds. Or no, actually I might put it towards my mini Monday challenges because those I like to wrap up at the end of the month. So miscellaneous is going to get 50, 20, 40, and 50. All right, and then gas has $10, which again will go over into my rollover. And gas is going to get 60. which I'm using less gas because I'm not going as many places. Giving is going to get five. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. All right. And so that is my wallet. Hit my elbow. All right. And then before we go into the other ones, I do want to show you this. So this is kind of like how I do my cash envelopes, sinking funds, all that kind of breakdown. So I ignore pretty much most of the numbers because I did not re-add this, but <laughs> it's kind of like my rough draft. Um, and then I finalize it once I actually go and pull the cash out. So anyway, I keep my you know wallet information up here. Then my sinking funds, I put them down as the binders that they're gonna go in, but I do you know, put that money in other places. Um, and then I have my the challenges that I'm working on. So my monthly challenge, my 50 envelope challenge. And then these are the days that I know for sure I'm going to be cash stuffing, which are Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. 
Sunday, Saturdays and Sundays are kind of like, eh. So typically my Sunday video gets this money, the binder money. Um, and then Saturdays could be a video like this one, or it could be some other kind of video. So Saturday doesn't necessarily have to be a cash stuffing day, but for sure, Monday, Wednesday, Fridays are absolutely cash, cash stuffing days, as well as my Sundays, because that's when I do my, some sort of sinking fund kind of thing. So anyway, I just kind of wanted to show you what that looked like and how I break that down. I am going to do more like you know, kind of back to the beginning, this is what my budget breakdown looks like because I know that I have a lot of new subscribers that are probably like, what What are you doing? How are you doing this? So I am going to start showing you guys the behind the scenes a little bit more. I was doing that in the beginning and then I stopped and went to just cash stuffing, but now I feel like I need to kind of bring that back in. So you will be seeing that very soon. All right, so moving on, let's do my monthly binder. And I have this one for June. And we will cross two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. Felt like there was an extra one for a second. And I'm going to put the $50 in here. And then, wait a minute, because for my Mondays, I would like to get, because ultimately this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to ultimately get this one caught up. I'm trying to get caught up to, um, so I can use this rollover money is what I'm what I'm doing. <laughs> In case you're like, what? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight times four is thirty-two, and I have thirty. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to finish this. just because I'm trying to get these caught up. And this is something that I already know that I would have done anyway. So <laughs> uh, let's just get it done now. So that way when Monday rolls around again, I can start working on the main one. Okay, so, and then I'm gonna grab $2 from my, I have like a ding, ding, ding reserve money stash. So I'm gonna just grab. from there all right and then that should make this one complete let's see 20 30 35 40 1 2 3 4 perfect okay so this goes in here with this one these this this challenge here is mine it is a digital download on my etsy shop so definitely go and check that out. This challenge is from Jesse Budgets, which I purchased these a little bit late in the year. So that is why I am now cash stuffing them. Um, so yeah, there we go. Okay. So June is now complete and move this back here and start working on July. Yay. All right. So that binder is done. And so I don't forget, let me move this one into that spot for Monday. Monday, I'll be like, where is my challenge? 
All right. Okay. And then last but not least, we have our 50 envelope challenge. Today I am doing numbers 12. And 40. Okay. So I've been stuffing the beginning and the end. Essentially, if you do... I got off somewhere. Oh, I'm not supposed to be doing that. Whoa, Brandy. I'm, I'm like, something is not right. I'm not supposed to be doing number 12. I'm supposed to be doing number 11. Shucks. It's 11. I don't know why I started counting backwards. <laughs> okay, I'll erase, I'll erase that 12. Um, but anyway, if you do the top to the bottom and kind of like line them up, it equals $51 each time. So for me, that was an easier way to budget the money for this to make sure that I always, you know, have the correct amounts budgeted. So 40 and 11 makes 51, but I like to round because I don't want any, I don't want all those ones in here because I don't want this to, you know, get too full. So for 11 instead, I'm going to put, I guess I could have put 11, but I'm just rounding because that's what I've been doing. So for 11, we're going to put in 15 because I would rather have more money saved in here than less. So we're going to put 15 for 11. And then for the 40, we're just going to put in the 40. All right. And everything adds up, which means we have $0 left, which means we are done. So um, this challenge i do not have available anymore i did sell out of them but i do have the 50 envelope tracker as a digital download and i do have these cute little pockets available as well in my etsy shop so definitely go check that out and that is it you guys thank you so much for tuning into this video today i hope that you enjoyed it if you did please give me a thumbs up also do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so and hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I post a new video. You guys are amazing. Be safe, be kind, or be quiet and be well. And I'll catch you in the next one.